Yeah, well, we just wrapped up a press conference with the Austin police to give us some more information. This is a scene right now still very active. Austin police say they are expecting to be here for the next several hours. We know one adult man was shot and killed. He was found dead inside of his car at this location in the 11,800 block of North Lamar. Police found him just kind of slumped over his steering wheel in the driver's seat. The body is still here, so we're trying to keep a safe distance from that. And Austin police are here and we know that there are several witnesses. This is a gaming. There's a gaming lounge here, a hookah lounge here. There were several witnesses who saw what happened. Austin police say a bunch of those witnesses are now at police headquarters so they can try to figure out what happened. But we do know the suspect is still at large and they haven't released a whole lot of information in order to protect the integrity of this investigation. I'll have more coming up at five o'clock. Back to you guys. Yeah, well, a couple of police officers were nearby the scene of this shooting, finishing up another case when they heard gunshots. And when they arrived here off of North Lamar Boulevard, they found that car smashed into a tree and the driver just kind of slumped over. They did try to perform some life-saving measures, but unfortunately, the man was pronounced dead on scene. That was around 2.15 this morning. This is in the parking lot of... Uh, Greek restaurant. There's a gaming lounge as well as a hookah lounge. Austin police say that they took everyone outside of those places to talk to them to figure out what exactly happened. The suspect is still at large. He fled the scene and police say that they have a couple of witnesses down at their headquarters in downtown talking to them and trying to figure out what happened. But this is an ongoing investigation. They say police are planning to be here for the next several hours and try to piece together everything that happened. And when we spoke to an officer to give us more information. He says they're not releasing a whole lot of information in order to protect the integrity of this investigation. And police did find a lot of weapons inside the victim's vehicle. Not sure if they belong to him or someone else, but we do know one man was shot and killed in this location. The suspect is still at large and police are talking with several witnesses. Well, the medical examiner just got here on scene. We know that a man was shot and killed in this parking lot. When police arrived, they found the man slumped over inside that car. You see it's kind of crashed into that palm tree. But the shooting was first reported around 1.45 this morning in the 11,800 block of North Lamar Boulevard near Breaker. Austin police believe there was a gunfire exchange and they found multiple weapons here at the scene. So far, no one has been arrested and there's no description of the suspect who left the scene. Officers were near the area at the time, so they were able to respond pretty quickly. When they got here, they found a driver slumped over the steering wheel. That driver was a victim and had been shot. They performed CPR until EMS arrived and took over, but he was pronounced dead just after 2.15 this morning. Police say the shooting took place near a gaming and hookah lounge, and about a dozen people were inside those businesses at the time. And police interviewed those people before letting them go. No one else was injured. Police do believe this was an isolated incident and they are planning to be at this location for the next several hours while they continue with this investigation. Well, right now, police still don't have a suspect in custody and they have not identified this suspect. They do believe the suspect and victim did know each other. So this is a live look of what is happening right now. The medical examiner is here. It's a pretty large crime scene and police say around 145 this morning. That's when they started receiving reports of a shooting in this area. An officer tells us police were near the area finishing up another case when they heard gunshots. Multiple officers showed up and saw there was a car crash into a palm tree. The victim who's died was also inside of that car. Police still don't know what caused the shooting, but they say there was some kind of disturbance between the suspect and victim. Information is very limited right now, and police are not releasing much in order to protect the integrity of the investigation. Multiple weapons were found inside the car where the victim was, but APD says they may not have belonged to him. Now, this is a pretty large parking lot with a lot of businesses. There's a gaming lounge, a hookah lounge with about a dozen people inside of those places at the time of the shooting. Police did speak to all of them and let most of them go. Those who did have information and witnessed what happened, they're being questioned right now at police headquarters. At this point, the man who was shot and killed has not been identified. Reporting live in North Austin, Jacqueline Turkesey and Fox 7 Austin News. Hey, good morning, guys. Well, the victim's 
Adams' car, or where he was found dead inside earlier today, is being towed as we speak. Police have a large portion of this area blocked off while they continue with this investigation. So that silver car you see right now, that is a car the victim was found dead inside around 1.45 this morning. We still don't know who the suspect is, and police say they are interviewing several witnesses trying to get a description of the suspect. They do believe the victim and suspect knew each other, but this shooting happened around 1.45 in the morning in the 11,800 block of North Lamar Boulevard near Breaker. Police believe there was a gunfire exchange, and they found multiple weapons inside that car you see being towed. They don't know if all those weapons belong to the victim. Officers were near the area at the time when the shooting first happened, so they were able to get here pretty quickly. They performed a CPR on the man when they found him dead inside the car, or they, he wasn't confirmed dead just yet, but he was pronounced dead just after 2.15 in the morning. Police say the shooting took place near a gaming and hookah lounge, and about a dozen people were inside those businesses at the time. So police interviewed those people before letting them go. No one else was injured. Once again, you're taking a look of the car. The victim was found inside around 1.45 this morning. Police are not releasing a whole lot of information regarding a suspect in order to protect the integrity of this investigation. So hopefully we'll learn more information as the morning progresses. Back to you. Hey, good morning, Dave. Well, police have cleared this scene now, so still not a lot of questions that have been answered at this point, but we know that police are still looking for a suspect involved in this shooting. The shooting was first reported around 145 this morning off of North Lamar Boulevard near Breaker. An officer tells us police were near this area finishing up another case when they heard gunshots. Multiple officers showed up and saw there was a car crashed into a tree, and the victim who died was also found inside of that car. Police still don't know what caused the shooting, but they say there was some type of disturbance between between the suspect and victim. Police also tell us that multiple weapons were found inside the car where the victim was, but APD says they may not belong to the victim. Police have not identified the victim just yet, and they are still hoping to gather information regarding the suspect, which is why they're continuing to talk with witnesses. Reporting live in North Austin, Jacqueline Turkesey and Fox 7 Austin News. One man was shot and killed in his parking lot behind me. Police are calling the shooting a gun battle and say it's possible that the suspect and victim knew each other. The shooting happened around 1.45 this morning in 11,800 block of North Lamar Boulevard near Breaker in North Austin. Police believe there was a gunfire exchange and they found multiple weapons at the scene. So far, no one has been arrested and there's no description of the suspect who left the scene. Officers were near the area at the time, so they were able to respond very quickly. When they got here, they found a driver slumped over the steering wheel. That driver was a victim and had been shot. They performed CPR on him until EMS arrived and took over, but he was pronounced dead just after 2.15 this morning. Police say the shooting took place near a gaming lounge and hookah lounge and about a dozen people were inside those businesses at the time. Police interviewed those witnesses before letting them go. No one else was hurt and APD tells us they do believe this is an isolated incident. Reporting in North Austin, Jacqueline Turkisi and Fox 7 Austin News. Right now, police do not have a suspect in custody, but are actively searching for him and hoping to identify him. An officer tells us police were near this area finishing up another case when they heard multiple gunshots. Officers showed up and saw there was a car crash into a palm tree. The victim who died was also found inside of that car. Police still don't know what caused the shooting, but say there was some kind of disturbance between the suspect and victim. Right now, information is very limited and police are not releasing much in order to protect the integrity of the investigation. Multiple weapons were found inside the car where the victim was, but APD says they may not belong to him. At this point, police have not identified the victim. They're still actively searching for a suspect and are talking to multiple witnesses trying to get more information. Reporting in North Austin, Jacqueline Tarkisian, Fox 7 Austin News.